Hey guys, happy Sunday. I hope you guys are doing well. Today, I want to talk to you about look at your heart. But first, let's turn our hearts to Proverbs 4, verse 23. It says, Guard your heart above all else, for it determines the course of your life. I want to ask you guys a question. Have you ever looked at your heart? Now, I don't mean literally. I mean spiritually. Are you allowing negative things to rot your heart? Or are you allowing good things? positive things to make your heart healthy. Sometimes that's the biggest key of living a happy life, having a healthy heart, not allowing bitterness, anxiety, overthinking, all those kinds of things that make your heart weaker, but allowing peace, patience, fulfillment, trust, God's goodness, make your heart whole. God loves you and God wants you to take care of your heart. The verse talks to us about how our hearts determine the course of our lives. Now are we allowing a healthy heart determining the course of our life or are we allowing the opposite? Now if you've been through a lot in your life, I want to pray for you. If you're watching this video right now, if you've gone through so many negative experiences in your life and it's been a long time since you've had a breakthrough, it's been a long time since you've been happy. You've been happy on the outside but deep down, you're crushed, you feel bad. You're sad. All these negative things. If that's you that I'm talking to right now, I want to pray for you right now. Let's pray. God, I lift up to you everybody right now. People watching this video that, that haven't had a break in a while. Their hearts have been so crushed with all the negative things and negative news they've been hearing, they've been experiencing in their lives. God, restore their heart. God, make their hearts whole again. As they watch and listen to this video, let this video serve as a funnel of your blessings, a funnel of your goodness that it will flow from you to everybody watching right now. God, make them feel brand new. In Jesus' name, I claim that whatever they've been through in their past, they never have to experience again any negative thing. God, guide them. Help them to realize and see your goodness overflow in their lives. In your name we pray, amen. Thank you for allowing me the honor to pray for you. God is gonna do great things in your life, claim it. Forget about the past. Forget about all those negative experiences. Focus on the future. Focus on God's goodness. Great things are happening right now. If you're watching this video, if you join me in that prayer, I claim and I believe that great things are happening right now. Let's claim it together. Let's not let doubt, let's not let the enemy have a foothold on our lives. For with the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, we have nothing to fear. The enemy cannot touch us. We are limitless in Jesus' name. Let's claim all these truths. Let's live for God. Every day, let's love ourselves. Let's love who we are. Let's embrace who we are and remind ourselves that there's so much yet to happen in our lives. There are still great things coming from God in Jesus' name. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, consider blessing with a friend, a family member. Remind people that it's important to look at your heart. Have a great week, guys, and God bless you.